In this video, I'm going to show you something I really, really like about Photo Studio. This is the contact forms. So you can go here to settings and you have contact forms. And there you can create one or multiple forms. Let's create the first one. Just press the new button and you, have, you will have a default form that will be created for you. Here we are just asking for the first name, last name, email, message, and how did they hear about you. This is a simple contact form. You can put it on your website. You can, of course, add more fields or change the order of the fields and so on. But one thing that is very nice is that if you put this field on your contact, uh, contact page on your website, for example, every time someone will fill this field, it will create automatically a prospect in Photo Studio. And of course, you will receive an email. And then you can customize this. You can, for example, uh, send uh, an automated reply to this, to this customer. When, when, when he sends you an email from your contact form, you can automatically send him a thank you email, for example. So you have many options here. And you can customize the look and feel. So if you want to change the color of the field, uh, everything, you can do it in the customize screen here. And you can see, for example, I want to change uh, the font, the colors, everything. You can really change everything, uh, every detail. So this form really fits perfectly into your website. So if I go back now, I can save the changes. Uh, how do you add this contact form on your website? Well, very, very easy. You have the get the code button here. And you have the direct link to your form. You can send it, of course, to a client if you want. Let's say your client contacts you on Messenger, you can send this thing to him. But it's better to include it in your own website. And to do this, you just have to copy and paste this. So this is just some HTML code you have to put on your website. It's working with everything, WordPress, Wix, every platform. It's easy to do. If you cannot do it, you can ask a question on our Facebook group or contact us directly, and we will help you do it. And just know one setting here, it is the height of the of the form. So if 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 the, this is too small on your web page, you can put it bigger. And for example, let's say here don't want to put like this, and it will be bigger on your on your page. Okay, that's it for the forms. It's very easy to set up, but it will make you earn a lot of time.